Uh, what my plan is right now is uh, after basic training, I'll go. Uh, I'll start going to college while doing recruit training. Now, National Guard deploys all the time for real. So they yes. actually go out. So if you're in school, are they? Is there a chance they'll deploy you? Yes, there is. But uh, you know, that'll just I'll just end up catching up. Here's the thing: is you go deployment, and you go as you know, Private Bob, not as Lieutenant Brown. My mom and my dad both. They didn't want me to go straight enlisted. Uh, they wanted me to have a college degree first. The benefits that the National Guard has is to uh, help pay for my college while I'm serving. I don't want to discourage you from being in the National Guard, but I'd really like you to get your degree before you go there, because I'd rather uh, you deploy as an officer than deploy as a... But I'd rather get my training in four years of my uh, career time off and while I'm at college. Garrison, college was never really on his radar. College is on our radar, and Garrison has had military on his radar. Him going in the National Guard and then getting the education money and stuff like that is really a compromise uh, for both of us. My, my biggest issue is I'd, if he deploys, I wish that he was an officer. Because the chances are we're at war constantly. Yes. We're currently at war. We've been yes, at and war I know for that that's 13 years. Part of it. If it comes down to that, then I'll be more than happy to deploy. Currently, the National Guard is deploying to our war zones. Soldiers are going to see danger, or they should expect that they will. And right now, because our National Guard deploys, there's a chance he's going to see deployment in the next four years. See, here's he's, the thing. I mean, like, he's 17, and he thinks he's invincible. At 17, you don't comprehend that you actually could get shot at, and those bullets might actually hit you. We don't like thinking that way either. That's not the optimistic line, but that is the reality we have to understand. And that being in the military is a sacrifice.